Like Muskegon County, Kent County is also accepting marriage licenses for same-sex couples. 24-hour News 8's Coco McAvoy spoke to the first same-sex couple to apply for a marriage license in the county. And she joins us live in downtown Grand Rapids. Coco? Good afternoon. It's been a controversial issue right here in Kent County where the clerk's office decided not to issue same-sex marriage licenses when it was briefly legal in the past. But today it was all about those people who have been waiting for this ruling. And we were here as this first same-sex couple walked through the doors. What is the date you have arranged with your officiant? Soon after the ruling came down that same-sex couples had the right to marry in all 50 states, Zach and Colby walked into the Kent County Clerk's Office to apply for their marriage license. We'll have you read the marriage laws. The couple has been together for four years and just had a wedding last weekend with all of their friends and family. This is fruition of what we feel is God's plan for our life. I mean, we love as deeply as any other couple and we've committed to each other for a life. And now that we can join our assets, we can have that same name. It's just, I mean, it means the world and I'm so thankful to be here. To become Mr. and Mr. Roanhorse. Do you guys swear to affirm all the information is correct to the best of your knowledge? You've read the Michigan marriage laws and you've been off of the HIV family. We do. But perhaps the best way to show what the couple felt in that moment was told through pure excitement from a complete stranger. It's amazing! Congratulations! Thank you. <laughs> I don't believe it! Sue Hood says she's been married to a woman for 24 years now, and seeing the joy on Zach and Colby's faces is what the day is all about. Generations of same-sex couples sharing in a moment that they thought may never come. That I had to live so many years in the shadows, and now I can, I am open, but I can be open for the rest of my life. To think we feel like we've been waiting forever and there are people who really have been waiting forever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we stand with them today. We send excitement and yeah. excitement. The clerk's office is still waiting on the official marriage license forms to come in from the state of Michigan and they hope those are here by Monday. Reporting live this afternoon, I'm Coco McAvoy, 24 Hour News 8.